All right, everyone. 3D Print 747. I'm back. And what we're going to do is slice this business card that I made in Tinkercad. But what I want to do is do the backing black and then the lettering white. Back in black? Huh. Backing black and the lettering white. So what we're going to do, I'm using a 0 .08 layer height so that it's extra fine. Um, we'll let the speed be whatever the default speed is. I'm not worried about that. The uh, strength, I'm going to do a 5% density with triangles. So it's kind of flexible. Um, we don't want it too stiff. Um, maybe even we'll go down to 4 to see uh, how that turns out. Obviously no support since it's flat. Um, and I'm not going to use um, a brim or a raft or anything like that. We're just going to print it as is. So let me go ahead and slice it. I've got it set up to go to my P1S um, generic PLA. So let's slice and take a look. So what I'm going to do is slice the print and then we'll put a pause in the layer that starts the lettering so that we can stop the printer, unload the black, and then load the white. And I'll show you how to do that in a little bit as well. So let's slice this. All right, so it's sliced. And as you can see, as we go through and look at each layer, we can see where the lettering comes into play, right? So what we're going to do is we'll go down to here. We'll lower it just to where lettering goes away like right there and then we'll bring it up one and then what I'm going to do is right click on the plus on the right and add pause and then it'll ask me to reslice it so it can put the pause in the g-code and we're ready to print 29 minutes so once this starts I'll take you over to the P1S and we'll go from there Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe.